Hello everybody, um, it's Jordan. I'm going to do my micro lesson plan for y'all today. Um, I'm gonna start off by saying I miss y'all. I miss being in class with all y'all. It's really, really hard doing this stuff without having the engagement to talk to all y'all. But let's dive right on in. So to start off, we're going to go over my standard. My standard is history, world history, D so it's hs.wh.i.cc.3, which is engaging or er, engage in disciplinary thinking and apply appropriate evidence to propose a solution or a design, an action plan relevant to compelling slash supporting questions in world history. So with this, it's more of like a critical thinking topic. Uh, it works more, it works better with projects and engaging in classroom discussions. So. For my I can statements, which we're gonna go do next, is I can work with a group to alter one important moment in history, and I can critically think with my group to analyze how that would change history. So my basic, uh, my basic lesson plan is titled the What If Project. So we're gonna do the first day of the What If Project, and to start, uh, to give a little background on it, um, historians often ask questions, ask the question, what if, as thinking, or as a way of thinking of history, for instance, what if Robert E. Lee didn't invade nor the North in 19, or in 1863? Would the South have been able to win the Civil War eventually? See, like, it, it basically just engages you in wondering, you change one little moment in history and you see how that would steamroll all the way up to modern history. So like, what if um, Lee Harvey Oswald didn't kill um, Lincoln? Like, how would that have changed everything? Um, it's basically just like, what would change? How would you change it? What other moments would be impacted? So to give you a brief overview of the assignment, students will be broken up in groups of three to f five. Sorry, my notes went away. And they will identify a specific event in history and change one thing about it with 80% accuracy. Which, when you change that one event, obviously you can't have 80% accuracy, but I'm saying that they will do it and continue to change all the way to modern history. So, like, the essential question is, what is the significance of the event being changed? So, like, you can do what if... Columbus never found America. Like, how would that change where we are today? Like, you can do other impactful events throughout history. So, today I'm going to be doing a little bit of modeling for y'all, um, telling you more and more about the project, and then students at the end of this will go over um, different things about like they will give topics about what they want to do. So to start off, I've already given you all the background of it. So we're gonna go over the modeling of the project. So let me flip my camera real quick.